everyone and welcome to another a thousand ways tutorial in this video I'll be showing you guys how to create a cube here in Illustrator using the 3d effect of extrude and bevel now this is very easy to do the only downfall with this technique is the fact that you can only apply one color to your cube the reason why that is is technically it's only one shape as you can see my path here it's only one square here the reason why that is, is because it's an illusion. We give off the feeling as if it's a 3D object when technically it's a 2D square. Now for those who already know how to apply this effect, you really shouldn't be watching this video. But if you want to learn how to apply different colors to this cube, simply go down to the link in the description below, which features another video showing you guys how to apply symbols to this cube. Now for those who don't know how to do this, simply follow along with me and create a new document. I'm going to press Command N on my keyboard and for PC users you press Control N. I like my settings here but you guys can choose whatever it is you want your document settings to be. I'm going to click OK and now I'll select my rectangle tool here. I'm going to hold down my shift button and create a square. I'll make it around 100 points. Now I want to get rid of this stroke here, so I'll just apply none and give it a fill of orange. Once that's done, I want to apply my effect, which I'll go up to Effect, 3D, Extrude and Bevel. Now this dialog box appear and make sure you have Preview checked. That way you can see all the effects being applied to your square here. Now you can change the direction of your angle and the way you view your cube by clicking on this cube icon here in the dialog box. You can switch it side to side or up and down, however you want. I'm just going to keep it pretty straight here. Now I'm just going to change the extrude depth because it's a little too thin. I'll make it about 100 points. Now in order to see what's going on, I just have to click away from this box. So I'll go up to perspective and click. And now you see 100 points applied. Now I'm happy with that, so I press OK. Within a few short, simple steps, we have what looks to be a cube. Thank you all for the support, and I hope to see you in the next 1000 Ways tutorial.